大家好，如果大家睇過上集嘅，就應該知道今集我將會有位重量級嘉賓出現。如果冇睇過上集嘅咧，咁麻煩你上翻呢條 link 睇翻我哋上集關於講新樂酒店嘅故事。好啦，有冇人估到我哋今集呢位重量級嘉賓係邊一位啊？估唔到啊！咁等我開估啊！呢位咧就係、是、千里迢迢由德國嚟到香港。曾經擔任聖方濟書院嘅老師，亦都曾經做過聖方濟書院第三任校長嘅巴德 Gregory。佢曾經教學生有一位我大家都認識嘅，就係、是、李小龍。收視咧，而家年紀已經好大啦，但係佢仍然喺非洲肯亞國家咧從事緊教育工作。二零一五年正值聖方濟書院六十週年校慶，收視。再被邀請翻到嚟香港參加校慶呢個盛會，而我哋都好幸運得到聖方濟好多舊生師兄嘅幫忙，幫我哋安排咗一場好長盡嘅訪問。喺訪問裏面咧，收視同我哋講咗好多關於佢自己嘅故仔，亦都講咗關於一啲佢同李小龍之間嘅往事。嚟嘅呢幾集咧，我將會同大家分享收視嘅故事。今集咧，大家都將會聽到。收視點解會千里迢迢由德國嚟到香港，去到聖方濟書院做老師嘅故事。So that the, the first question and.、Um... How and why did you become? Did you decide to become a brother? And、uh, which year you started to be a brother? Okay, as a student in the Maris Brothers School in Germany, I took a great interest in、uh, the, the mission life where the different brothers of Germany had been, and many of them came back from China. And also had they passed through Hong Kong, and they told us about the life in China. So that was my great interest, really, that attracted me. And there were some of the brothers who were here. They are well known even in Hong Kong still now, and to the schools in Francis Xavier College, like Brother Edward, Brother Conrad. His nickname was Coco, every,、uh, and、uh, and other. German brothers, so they came and told, talked to our students about their life in the faraway places like Hong Kong. That got me interested. Yes. Okay. Okay. So let's number two.、Um, how and when did you come to Hong Kong? What? Which year? You came to Hong Kong? Okay. After my.、Uh, College after college, in 1954 to 1958 in New York, Marist College,、uh, I came to Hong Kong, and I came to Hong Kong on through the Pacific Ocean by on a slow boat to China. The President Wilson,、uh, that was the name of the ocean liner, and it took about one month to from. Uh, San Francisco, Los Angeles, to come via Hawaii, to come to、uh, with a stop in Yokohama, Japan. Then we reached Hong Kong after one about a month. Yes, and I remember landing down there in the harbor of Hong Kong with great excitement. Do you remember which year that was? That was in 1954, in the summer of 1954. Okay, thank you. So the、oh, sorry, I made I made a mistake. Okay. That that was in 1958.、Okay. <laughs> you can correct that. <laughs>、okay. Yes, we, we can edit it. Yes, yes. yes. So, number three. At the time you came to here, Hong Kong, did you came here alone or with 
some other brothers. Okay. This was at the end of a school year in United in, in the in from the college and I came with a number of Filipino brothers on the same boat and also another German brother, his name brother Rudolf, who only passed away two years ago. And luckily uh, I was assigned to St. Francis Xavier College. My friend, Brother Rudolf, went down to Malaysia and he spent most of his life in Malaysia. Whereas I stayed here for about, for about 20 years in this uh, St. Francis Xavier's. And I think I was fortunate. Also, I met, we have some very famous people uh, that, that have passed through St. Francis Xavier's College. One of them is our great friend Bruce Lee. So, at the time you came to this college, um, what was your job? What, what kind of, uh, 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 what kind of things you, you were, uh, you taught to the okay. students? Uh, when I when I came here, I had majored in, in literature, English literature, uh, but. The way things were at the time, the school was still rather new. Uh, so I found out that, that I was uh, teaching a, a number of subjects. In point of fact, the principal at the time, Brother Kenny, an Irishman, he asked me to teach singing, music. I said, that one, I'm sorry, that one I cannot. <laughs> so I taught on other subjects like uh, geometry, algebra, even chemistry, and uh, languages, including French. Yes. So at that time, we had to sort of, uh, we have to be, had to be very flexible because we did not have so many, it was not so developed as it is nowadays, as it developed over the years. Thank you. So, which year did you become a uh, principal here? If I remember correctly, I think I became principal in 1971. That is after coming, yes. After having been a teacher here for all those years in between, with a break for uh, an, another year or two in the States and Canada where I continue, where I studied further. Thank you. I came back to Hong Kong. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you. So, how did you know, did you get to know Bruce? 